There's coming a revolution on this earth. It's already on the go. A revolution. Revolutions start because of unhappy people. And then they protest. They become protesters. I speak about worldwide. First peaceful protest. So it must be avoided. But you can do your small part. And if everyone do their small part, it can be avoided. It's not God's will. Revolution is never, ever God's way. You need to understand it. Because revolution is rebellion, and rebellion is witchcraft. You can never speak good about that. But if those who are in authority oppress the people and do not allow them to grow into what God wants them to be, they're going to be dissatisfied. You cannot stop that. And then the peaceful protest will go into a protest that's more violent. And then eventually, violent protest will go into a revolution. And when the revolution comes, people don't worry even to die. Do you think it's God's will? So I can advise you today to do your small part. Amen. By not calling people names to begin with, like I said. Number two, you need to allow people that is with you to grow into what God meant for them to be. Never suppress them. Amen. So now I give you the advice, which I heard from other men of God, and it's got this, uh, the same in my heart. We should avoid revolution at all times, because nothing good comes from a revolution. And I'm so glad I didn't speak, don't speak of my own heart only. Because you can say, hey, who's here to say that? Many other men of God are saying the same thing. God doesn't want revolution on the earth. I give you godly advice. Please, amen. You should allow people to grow with you, whether you're a businessman, you got your own business, whether you're a farmer, whatever you are, pastor, school principal, head of department, people that is working with you, you should take them with you. If you grow, you must allow them to grow. Say to God, if you grow, you should allow the people around you to grow. So you should take them with. Then you will stop revolution. Revolution is not God's way. Nothing, nothing good ever comes from a revolution. Nothing. It should be avoided. And the way to avoid it is to live by the words of Jesus. Hallelujah. I see what's going on in the world. There's revolution coming around the globe, around the globe, in every country. Already happened. And wherever there was revolution, success is gone. So it should be avoided by allowing, never suppress people and allowing the people that is with you, people that work for you, to stand up with you to grow with you and to prosper with you. Give Jesus a hand. Amen.